Good morning everyone and welcome back to Hogwarts Mystery. It's weekend and I'm not feeling particularly well today unfortunately. So I decided let's have our slumber party with our character and then use one of the skins or rather uh, clothing items that you that we were able to win in a previous event to just make the atmosphere as in we are just going to have a chill day. <laughs> or something of the sort. Um, even though it's actually not morning anymore, I was planning on recording this morning, but uh, I didn't. I'm sorry. Anyway, um, oh, my! There's an. This is a thing I wanted to capture that I haven't been able to because I was foolish enough to often just click the little button. But as you, you can see down in the corner next to the selectings. There is a little film scroll with a with a uh, with a diamond on it, or a gem. And if you watch a video, you can get three gems. So we're actually just gonna do that. Just a second. There we are. Um, I think actually I haven't seen this uh, before the latest update. I think was on the first of August. And it's really nice that it's been implemented. There is a chance that you can earn some gems, even more gems here and there. Not only taking class, you can also, I think it's a daily video um, that you can watch to earn three gems a day, I think. So that's not bad. That's a, like, that's a little nice giveaway, I guess. Anywho, let's wander around to our next assignment at Hogwarts. Even though we're having a weekend and we're just wa we're just wandering around enjoying our own business with our little owl here maybe maybe Chester should actually get a bit more um, time in the spotlight oh actually you you don't collect them in here you collect them here like there you go kitty <laughs> I forgot that last time and I connected collected energy that I didn't need to collect as of yet um, but the next thing we can do because we can't learn reduce here yet. That means we have to go and talk to Rowan in the Huff Hufflepuff house. Which means that our little weekend coziness can continue in our dorm with our other Hufflepuff friends. And I hope they get the memo <laughs> that it's weekend. <laughs> so let's go talk to Rowan. We're probably having our school uniform on. No, we actually didn't. But as soon as we talk to her, we probably have. Anywho. Um, people want to talk as well. I heard you learned uh, earned us ten house in transfiguration class, Ray. Well done. Jane is so happy because we usually lose points and not get them. <laughs> Do you have any advice for how to deal with Professor Snape? Hmm. Ignore him. <laughs> Ignore his comments. I, I think that's probably the only thing you can do with Professor Snape. You can't really put him in a box. You can't really make him smile or laugh. You can't crack a joke. He's not that person. So the best way to, I think, handle or deal with Professor Snape, which also can indicate a very more sinister what you want to do with Professor Snape. I think it means how you are going to manage your lessons with Professor Snape and not what you intend to do with Professor Snape. That's the word deal has multiple meanings, which is so fascinating with the English language. It has multiple meanings with fewer words. It's nice. Uh, <laughs> uh, I don't come across as feeling really poorly, but I am. I have been in bed all day and I still have slight cracks in my voice because I have a cold. Anywho, um, but my probably my, my best advice to you, young lassie, is that you um, you just ignore him. Just ignore his comments and don't feel bad about it because he's like that to everyone. Except his Slytherin things. He's even mean to them, but in a more friendlier manner, maybe? I'm not sure. I'm not quite sure, though. No. Last comment. Second year. Malrula is plotting something with a group of powerful Slytherins. So, we powerful Hufflepuffles, so what's the point? You might want to be careful. When in this game has our character been careful? 
that's probably the best question I could put out there. Like, our character is nowhere close to being anywhere near careful. Not even the slightest. <laughs> oh well. Um, let's go talk to Rowan here. She probably has some news about a plan that we made her concoct because we had to look go learn Reduzio, which we can't. <laughs> hey Ray, have you heard about anything about them? No, but if you work... Yeah, again, we, we are a little manipulative in some way, I would say, because we make her think and we being the tank. So what does that make Ben and Penny? And Penny is the potion, so she would be the cleric, I guess, and Ben... Oh, what would Ben be? Ah. Uh. Guys, what would Ben be in, in a typical role-playing setting? What, where will you place him? That, that could be interesting for you, me to hear. Because our character is definitely a tag because we're just learning all the things. We have a finger with a strategist. And then we have definitely a clerk with Penny because she knows all potions. But I don't know where to put... He knows a lot of charms, so he's probably a mage. Which fits Ben in well. But what do you think? I don't, I don't like to know that. Anyway. Um, no, but if you can work out a way to get us into the Slytherin common room, that black quill should help us find him. I had trouble with coming up with a plan until I remembered shrinking and engrossment charms. Okay, we already learned in Grotio. <laughs> and the big Gryffindor versus Slytherin Quidditch match. Oh yeah, they ma those matches last like forever until they catch the Golden Snitch, right? I'm not sure how I follow. Our character is definitely a tank because apparently we, our character is not able to think at all. Like. <laughs> Rowan is giving us all the hints, and our character is still like, mm, I don't know, what are you talking about? I'm not sure I follow you. Nah. No. No. <laughs> Everyone will be at the match. Everyone except us. When the students leave the Slytherin common room, you will shrink, sneak, shrink, shrink, sneak inside while the door is open. And relarge yourself. Re-enlarge. Not relarge, but re-enlarge yourself. The common room will be empty, and you will be able to grab the black quill and leave without anyone knowing. It's brilliant, isn't it? Yes, it's brilliant. <laughs> it's dangerous. It's quite mad. But I like. <laughs> But I would say it's brilliant because we wouldn't be able to figure out anything else at all in any way, sort of matter. Anyway, let's see here. It's really brilliant, Roman. I knew you would work out something. Huh. I will research the spells so will make sure make any everything safe, and I will be able to uh, be there the whole time to keep watch. So not only is she the finger, she's also our watchdog now. No, no offense, but that's the term you put out for a person that's keeping eyes a watchdog. Uh, but on the other hand, if if we send Roven in there, we wouldn't know what's happening. So of course our character is the one that goes to it, and of course the other keeps watch. <sighs> I don't know, I just wanted to be a joint effort, like, but it is a joint effort if she's keeping watch, though. It's just much more fun to have other characters with you inside, but maybe that's not the best thing in this case, I don't know. I trust you, Robin. I will learn those spells as quickly as possible. One more thing, Ray. The Slytherin Perfect is cunning, which is a trade for the Slytherins. They are ambitious and cunning. Um, which was the two um, main personal traits that came up when I, in the, in the past, took the test. It says I was a minor, tiny bit cunning, but really ambitious. But it only made me 49% Slytherin. And then 51% Hufflepuff. <laughs> 
<laughs> so you can kind of get like that's that's the interesting thing about taking those tests back in the day, like really back in the day. We took it as a fun thing, and we found out that uh, in my friend group we only have one pure Slytherin, two Ravenclaws, one Hufflepuff, and one Gryffindor. <laughs> So it, it was really fun to figure out. Yes, it was two raven claws because yeah, I was going. Why is it two half claws or two raven claws? It was two uh, raven claws at the time because we all took the same test, and we were shown the percentage, and those who weren't given the slithering house, they were all the uh, the other heart that fits them the most was Slytherin, so I was mostly Hufflepuff but also Slytherin. The other Ravenclaw, the Ravenclaws in my friend group was also only Ravenclaw and Slytherin. And the Gryffindor was only um, Slytherin and Gryffindor. And the one that was actually Slytherin, <laughs> this is funny, uh, had a 10% Gryffindor and a 10% Hufflepuff. And I don't know why I can remember those uh, those um, percentages, but it was just so funny because <laughs> it was like, oh, you're Slytherin, are you? Well, we, bas we basically are all snakes underneath the grass, <laughs> at least compared to the test we took. It was like, well, we seem to be mostly that, but we all snakes in the grass. We all know it. We all know it. <laughs> so anyway. He will know that Gryffindor might prank the entrance to the Slytherin common room while anyone, everyone is distracted. If he comes back while we are sneaking in, there will be trouble. I will take care of the prefect. Meet me later uh, to finalize our plan. Mm hmm. Sounds very sneaky, young, young, <laughs> young bright. Who is not so bright? It was actually a very well-fitting name for this character because she seems quite oblivious to everything. Like really, just oblivious. And. I, I don't know. <laughs> it's just... Uh, good we have Rowan, because else we wouldn't figure out anything in this game at all. <laughs> Anywho, um, with that, I actually think we can go take the Reduce You class, can't we? No, we can. Why can't we? We should be able to learn it. Oh, come on. That means we can't do any more. Aw, we can probably go have lunch for Rowan. Because I've realized uh, I have been grinding friendship points a bit on the side. However, I realized the higher you get in entropy points, it seems to be the higher amount of friend points you get as well. So I actually was slightly fearful. Oh, 30 minutes, never mind. Um, I found out this today, by the way. Um, I was slightly fearful for um, starting uh, gathering more friendship points now because. The higher attribute points, as you can see, I have, like, I already got a 20 day knowledge. The higher you seem to get in friendship points when you play gobstums with them or eat lunch with them. So I might take that back into account when I'm recording, due to the fact that I might accidentally level up my friendships without me even realizing it. So, I don't know. Why? <laughs> it, it, that's sad that we can't actually do more. This is going to be a short one. Oh, Isn't there anything we can do? Other than... Well, we... C can't... Can we? No, we can't. I was like, can we skip it? No, we can't. So, basically, we have to go to the Slytherin house. But we can't do that as of yet. Because we can't learn reduce you. And I hope that after we talk to Ruben, we will be able to learn the class, but no. And there's three hours we have to wait. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> I'm probably gone to bed by then. Oh no. Um, well, there's not really much more we can do at the moment then. Aww. <laughs> Aww. Then it's a short one this time, but it's been week and coziness with Mito Raider and her little slightly oblivious character. So until next time, guys, let's hope that we can actually do stuff, <laughs> do more stuff. 
and hopefully we are able to find Bin. So until next time guys, take care and have a fantastic day.